Hey everybody, I just wanted to show you a very bad race design. Not to say a terrible race design. So what if you play a race with minus food, minus production and minus research and then throw in the poor homeworld as well. Then you have 20 picks available and we're not going to use any of those. We're going to only look at this race with the minuses as they are here, except now if you go to the colony view you can see that we need five farmers to uh, feed our population five farmers produce eight uh, food in total which means we have three population left to uh, use for production or research and if we put all workers all to production then we have a maximum whopping three production here three whole production because we are on a poor home world and we also got the the penalty to production for the race so that's very sad if we put all the three guys to research we get a meager six research points per turn so for example if we want to produce a colony base we can do that in 67 turns or if we say no we're going to put everybody towards the research we have six points and that means if we do electronic computer for example six points 12 turns to do it uh, which is not bad in fact but then you need to do research lab after that and you're going to be a long way uh, getting that lab and the production sucks in the meantime because it's zero so that's not very good can this race even get worse than this i think it can let's take another look at this design so we had the minus farming, minus production, minus research, and the poor homeworld. And now we're going to throw in cybernetic. It has a plus value, but actually to this race design, it's very detrimental. Let's have a look how cybernetic works out in this situation. Again, we go to the colony view. Uh, we can see that we start with a si uh, situation of starvation. The game hasn't properly allocated the populations here. Uh, and we only have plus 23 growth, as you can see in the upper right hand corner. So let's add one guy from research to farming, so that uh, negative uh, grain is resolved. Um, but we still have uh, no zero production here. Zero production, and we're making two research per turn. So that's really our choice with this race, is to make one production per turn, net, so to say because five production, four of those productions are used f as food and only one remains to do actual production. So the colony base now takes us a whopping 200 turns uh, to complete or we can go two research points per turn and that means we're gonna do the electronic computer in about 32 turns. Very nice. Is this possibly the most terrible race you can imagine? I think it is. If you dare playing with this race, I wish you good luck and I hope you enjoy it still. Otherwise, pick a different race, design a different race and you'll have a little bit more uh, capacity to survive. But this is one of the worst races you can possibly imagine. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Enjoy Moo and see you later.